Tomorrow marks four months since the assault on the U.S. Capitol. Numbers show more than 400 suspects have been arrested from at least 45 states. Social media is a common theme tied to those criminal cases and the assaults. That has the University of Missouri system taking action through education. Joe Chiodo explains. Anti-vaccine QAnon extremists. GOP lawmakers who have promoted bogus conspiracy theories that the presidential election was rigged. Falsehoods from conspiracy theories to hazardous health advice circulating online. These dominating headlines have UMKC now working to give students a real education in fake news. Be skeptical about what you read. You can literally get buried and information about conspiracy theories for, for days, weeks, months. Dr. Beth Vanami, a UMKC associate dean and professor of political science, is launching a new class for freshmen. It's called Lies, Rumors, and Conspiracy Theories. It's a perfect opportunity to talk about how do you resist and sort of change the flow of misinformation. There are conspiracy theories on the left and the right, and uh, we will explore all of them. Too bad everybody in the world can't take this class. <laughs> I agree. I completely agree. The dangers of such conspiracies, though, are no laughing matter. We saw the ramifications of it on January 6th. A new Reuters poll showing 60 percent of Republicans still wrongly believe the 2020 presidential election was rigged. Venami says her class will analyze beliefs surrounding the election and what's created a cult-like following for the group QAnon. It starts with the notion that there's some sort of secret, and that's really powerful to people, right? You, I mean, we all want to be in on a secret. We all want to know something that other people don't. But beyond politics, her inspiration for the class was drawn from her own frustration. My Facebook feed, my Twitter feed, just like everyone else, is full of misinformation. You don't even have to go to your computer. It's right there on your phone at all times. A new report released this month by Advanced Democracy revealed troubling news about TikTok videos continuing to promote QAnon and anti-vaccine conspiracies. Views for such videos increased from 17,600 on March 5th to 1.1 million on March 29th. It's like any sort of addiction. Venami says if her class helps even one person avoid falling down the trap. Hours can be lost. People lose jobs. They lose family members, friends. Then she's done her job. That class will begin in 2022. And in case you were wondering, Vanami says she does not recommend deleting your social media, but rather make sure you get your news from multiple sources and make sure those sources are credible. Joe Chiodo, News 4.